Uh, well, my name is Leanne Kalita. I live down here on Hilton Head Island in South Carolina. I must say probably one of the most beautiful places on this earth. Painting for me is surely a second career. It's something that I had always wanted to do after viewing watercolor paintings in my grandmother's attic. Um, you know, as a little child, we'd go up there and we'd play around. And watercolor always stuck with me, but I didn't have the opportunity to try it or give myself the opportunity to try it until I was an adult. And once I started painting, I got hooked. I got the painting bug and it's something that I've been doing for about 30 years now. Watercolor was my first love and I've tried many other mediums and I always return back to watercolor. I love the translucency. I love the casualness of the medium. And I think it fits so well with the uh, many of the organic items that we can paint here on Hilton Head. This is, nature is just full of beauty and it's 360 degree turn and you'll find something to paint along the way. So I enjoy painting, oh, some beach scenes, uh, low country scenes, some of the specific uh, flora and fauna that we have in the area. And one of the paintings that I'm offering uh, to the foundation uh, is a painting of sandpipers along the beach. We see them all the time and I know up and down the East Coast for sure. And these sweet little birds that are out there and just moving along and getting their little beaks into the sand and groups of them. So uh, I am offering a painting of sandpipers. And I have it right here. There we go. So this is a little group of little sandpipers along the uh, along the shore there with the waves crashing behind them and all sorts of formations. I particularly love this little guy. We got a good little view of him. Um, but uh, this is my offering and it frames, it's transparent watercolor. All this work is transparent watercolor. So it lets the luminosity of the paper show through. And this one is framed out in a nice contemporary matte silver frame uh, to a 16 by 21 inch size. And I hope that it'll find a good home. We all work for organizations that are, that are dear to us in some way. And I would just appeal to anyone who has had a family member dealing with a, a, a brain tumor, going through the surgery or knows of one or has learned of one, um, I think this is a particularly strong organization to which we can, can help uh, in any way. And I must say that it hit a very special place in my heart because I have a very dear, dear friend who years ago was operated on for a brain tumor. Uh, I'm very happy to say that she survived it. She survived the surgery and she is doing well. So the organization holds a very special place in my heart and I'm glad to be a part of it and hope I can contribute in some small way.